It's Tuesday, April 10th, 2018. Let's take a look at the news. The headline on Drudge is Presidency Under Siege. And uh, as I'm sure we all know, the Mueller team has broken into the lawyer, uh, private lawyer of Trump, and stolen things. I don't ever remember that happening in America before. And, and what's astonishing is this headline from The Hill, uh, Schumer, it's time to vote on legislation protecting Mueller. Schumer says, law enforcement officers believe there's a good chance that the attorney for the president committed a crime or was involved in fraud where they couldn't have gotten the okay from the magistrate to make these seizures. So he wants to change the law to allow uh, this type of behavior. They're not the problem. The problem is all of us who are still sleeping zombies and just like, oh, that's all right. Yeah, right. Pass a law to make, oh, ooh, yeah. It's crazy. It's ridiculous. Yahoo.com. After no hell report, Pope gives the devil his due. So this crazy wacko Pope, after changing the the Our Father, saying there's no hell, then he goes on and on and on about uh, evil and the devil, uh, it, mostly in reference to fake news. And then he mentions hell, saying uh, in reference to people writing fake news, it is striking that at times, in claiming to uphold the other commandments, they completely ignore the eighth, which forbids bearing false witness or lying, and ruthlessly vilify others. Here we see how the unguarded tongue, set on fire by hell, sets all things ablaze. We're going to see more of this Pope, and uh, he is an interesting one. Wouldn't it be nice to crack the Vatican open and shine the light of truth within? From McClatchyDC.com, older U.S. emergency alert systems may not be secure, researchers find. A security company, Bastille, said Tuesday that it had found vulnerability in San Francisco's emergency alert system that would allow hackers to trigger the city's sirens or even blare out malicious messages. Now, what I found interesting about that article is that, according to the Q posts, it would seem that the emergency system has recently been sort of tuned up or tweaked or whatever uh, with the anticipation of the president using it uh, in the upcoming weeks when there might be um, a temporary blackout uh, on the mainstream. So the article almost reads like it could be uh, preparing people for some type of new narrative, you know, saying... Uh, don't believe, don't, don't listen to the emergency system. I mean, who knows? Obviously, Zuckerberg testifying. Uh, if you haven't taken a look at that, I'm sure you have. Just the pictures alone. Where did they find this guy? Another exciting day in America. And uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.